The search for the next chief of police in Baton Rouge is continuing, this time with public input. Tonight was the first in a series of meetings to help find the right candidate. Absolutely. Jacqueline Kissick went to City Hall. She joins us in studio with details from tonight. Jacqueline. Orne and Jacob, tonight's meeting was focused on how to move forward with choosing the next police chief. The mayor's police chief committee decided the 23rd is when the interview process will begin, but they want the public to compile a list of questions. I am very concerned. When it comes to choosing the next Baton Rouge police chief, the department transparency is on a lot of people's minds. We trust them with the lives of the citizens of this of this parish, of this city. And I don't think that there is any question in terms of their history that should be off limits. Tuesday, the first of several meetings to find Chief Murphy Paul's replacement by next month. In 2017, Mayor President Sharon Weston Broom created a search committee that chose Paul. Now the city does the same process again with several new members and public input. The committee is made up of local officials and city leaders. It's imperative to consider the needs of our community and commit to supporting the next police chief, no matter who they are. This past Friday, the list went from 24 to 21 candidates. Those that don't pass a public records request won't be interviewed. If it's not broke, don't fix it. Former NAACP President Eugene Collins is on the committee, and he thinks this process is the right one. From my vantage point, this is a good process. Our mayor has done a terrific job of putting this together, and I think we'll come out of this process with a good chief. Collins says he thinks Paul has been a good chief overall, and he hopes the next person picks up where the outgoing chief left off. So it's important that we get somebody that wants to continue to carry that mantle and we don't go and take steps back. This Friday there will be a special meeting in preparation for the next meeting October 23rd, the day the interview process starts. For the public to submit their questions for the committee to review, you can visit our website at brproud.com to find that email. The deadline is Friday at 3 o'clock. Now reporting live in studio, I'm Jacqueline Kissick, NBC Local 33 News. All right, Jacqueline, thank you for that tonight.